All right, you guys. I'm not gonna say what is up, Shark Goblin here, because today I'm hella pissed. So I was getting a gift card for a friend, and it was an eBay gift card. I was gonna be putting a hundred dollars on it. I tested the card to see if it was even gonna work to see if the $100 was gonna go through. And it wasn't working. And the reason I'm telling you guys about this is because I don't want any of you guys to make the same mistake that I did. So the car didn't work and I ended up calling the customer service center on eBay and seeing if they could try to help me out. Either, I don't know what it was, it was either it was something, but um, it was mostly, most likely a scammer. Because the guy told me that the money was on the card, but I had to go back to the store because it was, you either could put $25 on it or you could put a hundred. I mean, you could either put $25 or $200. So he told me to go back to the store and buy a $200 gift card. The first thing I did was end up buying a $100 gift card. He says, no, no, you have to buy a $200 gift card. And I said, but sir, I do have $200 now on, my two, on two gift cards. I have $100 on this gift card and I have $100 on the other one. He says, no, sir, you have to buy 200, a $200 gift card. So I go back into the store, buy a $200 gift card, and I put $200 on it, $200. And then I do all this stuff, yada, yada, yada. And he says, it's still not wanting to go through. Can you go back into the store and buy four two extra $200 gift cards. So I go back into the store and the lady's looking at me like, weren't you just in here? And I had this guy on the phone with me. And she could hear every, she heard every word because she told me this. And then she asked me, can you mute the guy off your phone? Can you mute him on your phone? So I muted the guy. And she goes, do you know this guy? And I says, uh, I said, yes, ma'am. He's trying to help me out. I said, I know, but do you know him? Like, is he a family member or something? I go, no, ma'am. And she goes, if I were you, I wouldn't buy that card. This next card, these next two cards. Because he's most likely scammed you. And she asked me, did you give him the numbers of the other, car, other two cards? I go, yes, ma'am. She says, well, it's unrefundable, and you've been scammed, babe. She explained to me how the, yesterday, which today is Friday, how yesterday a customer went in there and bought a $200 gift card. And he returned it back saying that wasn't working. They saying that he called some people and they had scammed him basically so the reason I'm calling is to let you guys know about this that if you guys get a call that says from Montgomery Alabama and it doesn't have a phone number on it do not call it do not answer it. That is most likely the scammers. See, they stole $400 from me because I had bought a $100 gift card on eBay. I mean, from on, e on an eBay gift card from Walmart. I then bought $300 on two extra eBay gift cards from Dollar General. I screwed up in a big way. 
and I've learned my lesson. But the reason I'm posting this on here is to let you guys know that if you ever buy an eBay gift card, make sure that it is activated and make sure that it is working because once you scratch that card, you won't be able to get your money back. And hang on. And so I'm just letting you guys know this because I fucked up. I'm saying that. I, I did. I screwed up. And I'm posting this video because I don't want any of you guys to be making the same exact mistake that I am making, that I made today. Yes, now I gotta pay off my now I gotta pay back home all that money for the next paycheck. But I've learned my lesson. And that is why I'm telling you guys right now, do not ever buy an eBay gift card, ever. If you're going to buy something off of eBay, do it with a debit card or credit card. Never, ever buy an eBay gift card. And that is the reason why. is because you will most likely get scammed. And the card that I got, it was a purple and yellowish blonde card. I'll show it to you guys later on. To show you guys what it looks like once I get back home from dog walking. I've already done told my friend about this and I told him how it was meant to be a surprise and I got that screwed up basically. And this is why my friend doesn't buy from eBay. And I told him, I said, it's not eBay. It's not the website's fault. It's the card's fault. And it's the people who are trying to, who I thought were helping me out. So yeah. From now on, I'm no longer buying an eBay gift card. If I buy the item for the friend, I'm gonna first find out what the item is that I'm buying. And I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna buy the item using my mom's or my debit card. I will no longer buy an eBay gift card. You hear me, eBay? You guys have lost my trust. So, from now on, I'm not gonna do it anymore. The only gift cards I'm ever gonna buy are restaurant gift cards, or I'm gonna buy my Xbox gift cards because those always work, so, yeah. But I just thought I'd let you guys know as a warning. To any of you kids who think, oh, let me buy a gift card and let it be an eBay gift card with my money. No, do not buy that. If you're gonna buy an item off, if you're gonna buy an item off of eBay, ask your mom. Because this is what I do. I always give my mama, my mom, the money. And then I ask her if I can buy it on her card. Or I tell her, Mom, I'm going to buy this off your card. Here's the money in return. We sort of do a trade. I buy it on her card and I give her my money. Using her money and I give her mine. So, yeah. Do it that way. Because it is a lot safer than you risking yourself to buy a $50 gift card or above to get an item that you want. It ain't worth it. Just buy it off a regular debit card or credit card. So, I've learned a lesson from all this. I hope everybody who watches this video can learn something from this. And I hope you all pass the word around. And please do. Okay? And I'll talk to you guys later. Sure, Goblin, out.